up guys, it's Susan. Welcome back to a brand new video. And today I'm super excited because we're gonna be designing my dream room. Let's go. One quick thing to say is there will be a bar like this one that will pop up in the video to show you the progress of the room. Part two, planning. I'm just drawing out what my room is supposed to look like after I redesign it. You don't see as much detailed drawing from a top-down angle, and the bed is way smaller than it's supposed to be. Whatever, no one cares anyways. Why did I do that? I, I just should have used the bed. Let's look at some wallpapers. This one is too crazy. This one's clean and minimal, I like it. Meh, too expensive. Hmm, which one should we do? I think I like the gray brick wallpaper the best. Let's plan it out. So we got the wallpaper, four racket shelves, two on each side, and the neon sign in the middle. That looks good. Part three, redesign time. This Echo Show 5. That is nice. Alexa, goodbye. Talk to you later. I'm sorry, Alexa. All done with that. Do I see 473 subscribers? Hold on, one sec. Time to put more stickers on the sticker ball. If you haven't seen that video, go check it out after this one. So we went to Target and we picked up some stuff. Bam, bop, pow. So we got the color changing light box and the LED strips. So we just got the LED strips hooked up and I mean, it's looking kind of dope. Let's replace the keyboard. Much better. We got some packages. All right, so we got the stuff. So the wallpaper is gonna be up in three, two, one. Now the next piece. The most amazing thing is each one of these brick slabs are 20.5 inches wide, right? We were worried that the last piece we'd have to have an extra little sliver or cut, but it was 20.5 inches exact. We are done with the entire wall. There's a gap. Now I have to take this out. Another IKEA shop, our last one. Let's go. Two more ekits done. Another thing we got is this starry night light. Basically, it projects like a galaxy or like stars onto a roof. This is my sister. There's a slight problem with this. When I plug it in, it just falls out. I need to fix that. 
This might be a dumb idea. We're gonna hot glue it. As you can see, it is very rusty. But, okay, so. What? Oops, let the And it works. Bluetooth yeah. connection. Yes. Now, we also got the smart plug. This remote basically can control this light right here. Here, let me turn off all the lights. Alexa, bye. Okay, so we built the Akat shelf. Now all we gotta do is put it on the wall. But we already did. So we got this one here, this one. We got this one right here looking really nice. And this, super dusty from the sawdust. <coughs> so, by the way, the room is a disaster. That's what it looks like. Now we just gotta put in this fire thing in here. We just got to fix something right here. It's nice. I fully decorated. This, I got to put batteries in. This will be my studio and I'm gonna have a stand behind that so it glows like that. Also, in each one of these Eket shelves, I will have color changing lights. These are just white. I can already imagine this being a crazy setup. Yeah. Here's what it would look like normally with no crazy lights and stuff. My desk for my YouTube studio is this old folding table that we found in the garage and a piece of wooden plywood. Okay, this is weird. So, about six months ago, I ordered a neon sign from this company called Your Turn Neon. This company tried to scam me. So it started off November 28th, me requesting the sign. November 30th, hi, thank you very much for getting in touch. I'll send this image to a designer. Okay, no response for over a week. Then I sent another email saying I need the quote because the Black Friday deal ends at December 6th and they waited till after so I couldn't get the 40% off. And multiple emails sending back and forth, we finally got them to give us the 40% off. These guys were such a freaking pain, you don't even know. So I order it. One week go by, nothing. Two weeks go by, nothing. Three weeks go by, finally I say, hi, I'm just wondering, when is my neon sign going to arrive? I'm super stoked. They come back to me with an automated message. Another week goes by and I send another message. I said, it's been almost a month and there's still no tracking number. I need the sign ASAP. Where's my sign? I ordered it at the beginning of December. Hi, I have requested my manager call you with an update. <laughs> and do you think they called me with an update? No, just just no. Anyways, long story short, it got so bad that the bank had to get involved. Let's just say they got so scared that they sent the package all the way from China in one day. There's some other pretty crazy stuff that they did, and I want to save that for the video I'll make about them. I just don't want something like this that's in my room. This company, it's like weird vibes. It's like really weird vibes. Okay, um, this is the sign. Uh, it's super weird. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Shizen, Rembo, Technology Co, Bulgazen, Jian, the Lingshan Town, Dongyang. This is not even UK. What? This is really, really weird. Not gonna lie, that looks awesome. Definitely not cheap. They put hearts for the wrapping paper. They're just trying to be extra nice because they know what they've done to me. If this room video was supposed to be out like years ago. Okay, I'm gonna turn it on. Three, two, one. Why isn't it turning on? Oh my gosh. Okay, that is crazy. 
this is a remote. So you got a couple modes on this. You got a blinking mode, this mode, whatever you call it, and this normal. Then there's mode. a slider to adjust the brightness. Tell me that's not fire. Like, look at it. It literally brightens up the whole room though. Okay, this is my setup. Soon we're gonna have a light, a softball. Right now, it's dark, my face. So, I got some new pop lights for my room. Let's check it out. We got these batteries for a dollar at the dollar store. Pretty good. So this video is finally complete. It's crazy how much this room has changed. This is before. And this is after. That basically wraps up today's video. Oh, and one more thing. A thousand subscribers is coming around the corner, huh? Wonder what we're gonna do then.